Hey church family, it's Wednesday, and you know what that means. We are at our location for We Eat Out Wednesday. Before I reveal it though, I'm gonna wait a few minutes. Uh, it's 10.59 and we post at 11 a.m. And I'm gonna wait for a few of you to get on here. I see Phyllis Campbell. Hi Phyllis, how are you? Uh, and then I'm seeing some other people. Uh, Viola, hi Viola. Miss you, miss seeing you on Tuesday mornings. Uh, waiting for a few more people to jump on here before we reveal our restaurant that we will be blessing this week. Uh, this comes off of a recommendation uh, and it just so happens that I actually love this place. Now, some of you have been recommending restaurants and so let me, maybe I failed to give you kind of a little bit of a criteria on what we are looking for. Uh, one, that they're family owned and they could have multiples, so that's okay. That's awesome if they have the ability to own different locations. The biggest thing is they have to be open for dinner. I know some of you have recommended some uh, spots that are really, really good, but they close early. And so if they close early, we can't go have dinner there. Some of you do have lunch and that's awesome, but a lot of you are going out to eat dinner uh, or order mm -hmm. dinner for your family. So it must be open for dinner. Uh, so, and I get it. A lot of restaurants are struggling right now and we would love nothing more than to be able to bless everyone, but we can't. So we're doing the ones that we can. They have to be open for dinner. Uh, it's a huge criteria and it's gotta be a dinner meal. Uh, Cause there's a, a, a place that I was gonna do and I like it, it's great for lunch. Uh, and it ended up being that they're not open for dinner. So, but for me personally, a sandwich is not dinner. Like a hamburger is dinner. Uh, a chicken, fried chicken sandwich is also dinner, but like a ham sandwich, like Jimmy John's, that's not dinner. That's a lunch meal for me personally. So anyway, that kind of just gives you an idea. There's a bunch of you on here now. That's awesome. Uh, so today's spot is located just about two miles west of Not Avenue Christian Church. And it's located on Ball Road. And I believe that behind me is Moody. I could be wrong, but I think it's Ball and Moody and it's Joe Schmoes. This place is awesome. They got great food. My newest favorite thing here is their Nashville chicken sandwich on Texas toast. It is amazing. You gotta have this thing on. I'm gonna take it off because I'm talking and I'm losing my breath here, but you have to have a mask if you come in here till, uh, I'll show you the sign here in a minute. Whew. If you wear these things, they're hard to talk for a long time. Anyhow, so their Nashville chicken sandwich is amazing. Uh, their corn dog, believe it or not, I like to think of it, it, it's a lot like the Disneyland corn dog. If you ever had a, dis, a corn dog at Disneyland, it's amazing. Well, Disneyland's closed. So just come on over to uh, Joe Schmoes and you can have a Disneyland corn dog. Their corn dogs are amazing. Hey, Wendy Lopez. So, and hey, Beth Long. Uh, so again, Joe Schmoes right here on West of Not, uh, Not Avenue. It's on Ball and Moody. Uh, and so come check it out. It's great. The best thing to do is go on their website uh, to Joe Schmoes. And I'm going to try and get some pictures here for you here in a moment uh, when I get out of my car. But uh, go to their website, order online, and then just pick it up. Uh, it's the best thing to do. Uh, so again, let's bless the heck out of Joe Schmoes. Uh, we love them. They have been awesome to our church family uh, and a couple of things that we've done when we decided early on we wanted to bless the teachers. This is where we got them the gift certificate to. Uh, so they're just an awesome family-owned restaurant. Uh, if you didn't know, Joe Schmoes actually, uh, the owner of Joe Schmoes also owns Catella, not Catella Deli, I'm sorry, uh, Gourmet Cafe, which is on Catella and Walker, right across the street from Costco. Uh, also great, and I know they're open as well, so if you wanted to go there instead of here, hey, let's just bless the owner, whether it's over there or over here, but check it out. So here you go. See, you got your mandatory mask, mask zone. Sorry, but we do not, uh, we need you to cover up until you are seated. And then here, if you have your phone and then you can hit pause and then scan that, that'll give you the uh, menu. Uh, and then again, you can online. Uh, they have all this kind of cool little deal here where you pre-order pickup, dine in, walk in, ordering, all that stuff. So again, Joe Schmoes, again, Nashville chicken sandwich is awesome here. Uh, so again, church family, thank you for continuing to participate in these Wednesdays. Uh, we eat out Wednesdays every week. You've been an amazing blessing to 
And it's crazy because we think we're blessing just the owners, but we're blessing the employees who work here uh, because these company, these little restaurants are staying in business. They're uh, continuing to keep their employees employed. Uh, and again, if you're able to tip well, even though you're not sitting in at their table, tip them well. Uh, it just blesses them. And again, when you come here, just let them know, hey, we at Nod Avenue love local businesses and we support them. Uh, so again, thank you for recommending uh, these, some of these places. Um, again, if you have another uh, recommendation for me, uh, just let me know. Again, remember the criteria, got to be open for dinner. Ho hopefully it's a dinner kind of a meal. Uh, and think of something that everybody, because again, I, I want to do a sushi place, but I know not all of you like sushi. Uh, so that's why we haven't done one. Uh, so, but anyhow, let me know if you have any other recommendations. I'm going to go pick up my food because I already ordered it online. Uh, and their Nashville chicken, I ordered the Nashville chicken salad because, you know, trying to get this COVID weight off, uh, COVID-19, because literally I think it's COVID-19 pounds. I think that's why they call it COVID-19. I don't think it's because of the coronavirus. It's COVID-19 because of the 19 pounds we've all put on uh, on this uh, crazy times. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to go pick up my salad. Uh, so guys, enjoy. Have a great meal. And again, let's bless them.